Oh, let's go look around. It's so weird being back on this boat. Where's my sport? Check my six pack. <laughs> That's cute. Main and vehicle. Okay, I'm not about to read everything. Who are you looking for? Morning. Hello. Enjoying the ride? I don't think I could ever get tired of this. Agreed. Where are you headed? Uh, Delos Crossing. Same here. You from around here? Okay, we're not about to have a full conversation with him. Oh my goodness. Born and bred. Ah, you don't say. I moved to Anchorage around your age. Delos was mostly Alaska natives then. Blake and I know. I haven't been home in five years. Okay, that's nice. Okay, what's this? When everything else fails, try doing with it. Try doing with the captain's possession. <laughs> Charming. Am I going here? No. Hey, Allison. Can we take this scenic route instead of the highway? Allison? I don't think so. Guess not. Hey again. Fancy meeting you here. Hey, didn't we used to swim off that dock? Wait, no. That was on the Oh, uh, they pulled that one out. What? No. Man, so many good memories. Of course. There's nothing like the open air. Hey, you send your application to Denali yet? Uh, not yet. I need way more experience. You're not applying to run the entire national park. They've got to have something entry level, right? Yeah, but I've done no internships, no volunteer work. They probably get hundreds of applicants, and I've got nothing to show. Come on, you don't know that. Doesn't hurt to try. Okay, am I looking for something? I think I'm gonna sit in the car for the rest of the ride. Yeah, I'm good. I thought we were still on the boat. Like, why she start in the car? In the woods. Yeah, this ain't safe. I'm up the woods like that. No, I'm good. Is 
Is it private property? Oh, it's a little, little nice little tiny house. Wow. It's basically exactly like I remember it. Only faded. Like a Polaroid left on a windowsill. From the outside, it almost looks charming. Charm's not the problem. Structural integrity may be an issue. You think there's a chance whoever buys it will just tear it down? If someone buys it, they can do whatever they want with it. You wouldn't care at all? Would you? Sure. Everywhere I look, I see a piece of one of our adventures. Everywhere I look, I just see her. Allison, we could go grab a bite. Start this tomorrow? No. The only way to get this done is to do it. After you. All right, where are we about to go? Man, this ain't safe. Like, I'm looking at my surroundings. I'm not liking this. Uh, did you smoke something before you left Fireweed? The door is right there. I couldn't check the window, girl. Come on up. Locked. Well, it's a good thing I remembered this. You sure that's the right key? Yes. Maybe someone changed the lock. Who would change the lock on us? I don't know. We're screwed. You got a plan B? Yeah. We find another way in. I never knew a locked door that could keep the crafty goblins out. Yeah, we had a million ways in and out of this old house. At least one of them's gotta work. Now let me go back to the window. Might be unlocked. I could break a window. You know civilized people don't do that, right? Oh, so we're civilized now? Well, maybe not. But we are trying to sell this place, and broken windows aren't exactly amenities. Okay, so we can't do the window, then. You can't look too, nah. <sighs> the crafty goblins. I haven't thought about them in forever. Or should I say, us. We almost spent more time as goblins than we did as kids. Oh, do you remember all the other characters? The moon hag, the ice king, the old bear. Most of them, I think. But the details are fuzzy. Hey, do you know what happened to the book with all the stories? No, no idea. But I'm sure- How did she get around on these roads with this thing? She'd rather have broken her neck than spend money on a new one. Yeah, still waiting for those bikes she promised us. Uncle Eddie got me one, but I hardly ever used it. Hey, it's locked all right. At least the shed's still standing. Yep. I don't want to think about what might be living inside it, though. Well, better alive than dead. Ugh, yes. Let's deal with that later. Plenty else to do first. You need a hand with that? <clears throat> no, it should be fine. Okay. If we just get this board out of the way, I could probably squeeze through. So we need something to pry it off. It's screwed in pretty good. We need a screwdriver. Okay. Let's see. Where can we find a screwdriver? What's over here? You really want to go out there? No, you're right. Can you look? Do something? 
instead of following me? Supposed to be in this together. I can't believe these are still here. Yeah. We should hide them so they don't frighten away potential buyers. Oh, look at here. Okay. Should be something in here that'll work. Hey, I see a screwdriver. Now all we need to do is get inside. Wait, I, um, I'm feeling something strange. And don't leave this room until everything looks as clean as a whistle. Ugh. This is the millionth time I've gotten in trouble because of you. You and your big mouth. Hey, you were thinking the same thing. You just weren't brave enough to tell her. What good would it do? It's not like she ever listens to us anyway. Well, I'd rather scream it right in her stupid face than be a quiet little mouse. Oh, we forgot the key. We need to put it back. Maybe we could hide it somewhere. You know, for fun. Goblins are supposed to help the princess, not play mean tricks. Whatever, you're not fun. I'm only trying not to make her even worse. Whoa. Did that just happen? I don't know, but I saw it too. It felt like it did when we used to share thoughts with our voice. It did, but that was a memory of us 10 years ago, right? I, I vaguely remember it happening. I think so. And uh, that's new, right? Yeah. We could share thoughts and feelings, but we never replayed memories like that. Why would it happen? And why that memory? I don't know. It's pretty eerie. It's weird, but our voice was always a good thing. This could be too. I'm feeling something again. Near the barn. Yeah, me too. Okay. Coming. What? Stop sulking. I told you already. I'm sorry. No, you're not. <laughs> okay. Guess you don't want to see what I put in the treasure room then. What? No, I want to see. I guess we know where to search now. We just have to remember which one is the silent frog. So, Nothing here. which one of you is hiding the key? Hmm? Damn, where's the key? Seriously? Kidding. Oh, come on. <laughs> okay, okay, sorry. Nice job keeping a secret, buddy. There we go. What's this? left this box here. It looks brand new. It wasn't me. Has someone been out here recently? Guess it's your lucky day, bird friends. Got it. All this for a screwdriver? You got a better idea how to get in? Um, that could have been a sign that a stranger was out here. No, just me? Okay. You sure you want to go in there? This was our very first den, remember? Who knows what lives down there now? Everything okay down there? Tyler? Ah! Oh, that's not funny! <laughs> then why 
why am I laughing? Okay, fine. But you're still an idiot. All right. I'm going in for real this time. Okay. I'll see you at the front door in a few minutes. You remember dragons. Straight ahead. Need to go left, I think. Then left again after the goblins. Wow. Can't say I ever expected to see you again. It's been a long time, buddy. It's so cute. collection okay I would have taken the gold not even in your dreams nope it was on the right my bad Past the treasure. Straight, Straight ahead. ahead. You know, I almost convinced myself our voice was just another childhood fantasy. Me too. The Mad Hunter. Why am I still afraid to say his name? It was Mary Ann's creation. She made all the creepy characters. That opening is good to have and also not good to have. Because somebody can just sneak up in your house just like that. Oh, this little... Not like a grandma type of feeling. I am not going upstairs by myself. Listen. Are you okay? I'll live. Good to hear your voice again. Yeah, same here. So, coming in or what? Just working up to it. Well, we're here. Here we are. So, how do we get started? We figure out what to keep, what to trash, and 
See what else this house might be trying to show us. Okay. Homecoming. Right, let's see. Broken shelf, broken jar, and the washing machine. Broken. <laughs> the dryer never worked to begin with. Marianne thought dryers were straight up evil. Energy hogs. I hated hanging drippy laundry. I refused to change for a few weeks once, so I wouldn't have to do it. What? Place needs some string, glue, duct tape. The holy trinity of house repair. Marianne loved having something to fix. But not the part where it got broken. Especially if we were the ones responsible. I know. I'm just saying she liked to say- Guess we never had time to complete the collection. These came out of one of the prize machines at the Vecchi store, right? Yeah. You'd slide the quarters inside on the little tray, and then magic, out pops a sticker. What is this? Oh, no, I'm not about to read that. Oh, y'all can see that? Y'all good? All right. What are you reading? I don't know. Oh. A letter we wrote her. To apologize for breaking that stupid face, remember? Bore your kids into good behavior. Great parenting strategy. Wow. I'm so embarrassed for us. Many Da Vinci's we were not. She saved every drawing we ever did. There's a couple of these at my keep. She took so many pictures. Yeah. Like she had to document every second of our lives. It made her happy. And it was kind of nice to see her smile. I guess. You okay? All these happy pictures. They look so sad now. Mom? About me joining the hockey team? Mom! Sorry, what? Uh, not now. Maybe next year. But you promised! Keep whining, and my next year will become never. Can you cut my hair? Your hair is fine. But I want to cut it short. Really short. What? Look, I'm tired! And I'm busy! Let's talk about this later. You always say that. Marianne said no to everything. It made me so pissed. She was always on edge those last few months. Yeah, and completely deaf to everything I was telling her I needed. She pretty much always said no to Marianne's room. Let's not go in there until we absolutely have to. Agreed. Okay, so we've seen everything, really. So, what's up? I thought this was two-story house. It looked like one store on the outside. Is she coming? I'm not coming up here by myself. Come on. Is she really not coming? Wow. Yo, what are you doing down there? What do you think I'm doing? Trying to figure out if anything in Marianne's mess is worth keeping. Any progress? Not really. What about you? What are you doing up there? I'm tired of her mess. Let's dig into ours. Right. Guess it's time to mainline nostalgia.
Where'd you come from? This, this feels like home. Hey, the postcard we sent ourselves from Juno. Forever alone. What? We barely had any friends. We even had to be our own pen pals. Okay, when is the scene gonna come in? Like, how long we gotta look around? Look what I found. What? Only our greatest creation, the Book of Goblins. <laughs> Seriously? It was in that chest the whole time? All these stories. I had ideas for so many more. Marianne wrote a lot of them. Yeah. It's one of the only times I remember her being... At peace. You telling me little kids wrote this? You might as well write a, whole, write a whole freaking book. Like a book book. This is wow. Oh my goodness. Ah, where is it? You looking for something in particular? My diary. You never told me about it. Yeah. With the way Marianne was, I tried extra hard to keep it a secret. Marianne. Yeah, that day she found out about it. Is it weird for a guy to have a diary? Mom, where is it? What did you do with it? What now? I can't find my diary. I know you stole it. Give it back. Sweetie, whatever I do, it's just for your benefit. You read it, didn't you? You had no right to do that. I have the right to do whatever I need to protect my little girl. I'm not your girl. I hate you. You will always be my little girl. And no matter how hard you fight me, I'll fight twice as hard to keep you safe. I know you lying. He w that was a boy this whole time? I thought that was a girl. <sighs> I don't know how I never saw it coming. She told me right to my face. She was willing to hurt me, to keep me from transitioning. Tyler, there is no way you could have known she'd go that far. I want my diary back. Her room was the only place I didn't look. Okay, but do you need to get it, like, now? That diary was important to me, Allison. Writing down my thoughts helped me realize who I am. Well, then let's go find it. You think her room is still locked? It always was. I know, but we'll have to eventually, and I need it back. Ice King finally caught the hag. His furious voice could be heard throughout the forest. For your wickedness, you will be eternally bound to the lake. 
What? No way. Quiet, let me finish. You will no longer be allowed to leave. Not even under a full moon. The moon hag was imprisoned in the lake, and she never again tried to escape. Hmm. And then the title. What do you think? Not bad, right? Uh, I guess that's okay. But I would have changed the end. What? No way! The Ice King. I totally forgot about him. That's because it was dangerous to mention his name. He was too powerful. Hold up. What? Remember this? Uh, unfortunately. You must solve my riddle to earn the right to enter the princess's sanctum. Nothing a good hard shove won't take care of. I mean, yes, we could brute force it, but it might be kind of fun to finally solve it, right? We have different definitions of the word fun. Okay, well, if we break it, we're just gonna have to fix it for the sale. So let's at least try not to. You have the Book of Goblins? Man, I'm with him. Yep. Hand it over. What are you looking for? The image on the door. It's making me think of a story from the book. One that Marianne wrote. You have a way better memory than me. Well, the Book of Goblins was my creation. And you'll never let anyone forget it. Here it is. The one about the princess's party. Give it a read. I think the symbols may represent something oh, in the story. Oh, come on. Nah? First ghost memories, now storybook puzzles. What a weird day. What a weird childhood. Touché. You know I hate puzzles. She couldn't even show me the page that she was talking about. Ain't nobody trying to read all this. We got the moose. I think the bear did the, the um, I'm not gonna lie, I think the bear did that one. And then, you see the fog. No, 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 no. I think I'm just gonna force this open. You sure? We're not in a rush, and we'll have to fix it. All right, one more try. Goose, yep! Uh, this room dark as hell. And boom. Oh. We're in. That's pretty. this to feel more, you know, like a win. Speak for yourself. I'm the one who solved the riddle. Why do I feel like you're not going to let me forget that? Where do you think we should start looking? I don't know. Where in this mess would she stash someone else's personal thoughts? Why the hell does she have a riddle to open her door? Like, what does she forget? She just locked out of her room? I just can't get through. Whatever's going on, they won't let me in. <sighs> they used to tell me everything, but they shut me out, Tessa. They've shut me out. I've had so much on my plate lately, and... 
and they're convinced I'm the enemy, and I don't know why. I need them. I need my goblins. I remember now. We heard her crying. We listened through the door. Seeing her like this, as if she's still here, it's... It really sucks. She was really coming apart those last few months, wasn't she? It's here! I knew it. I fucking knew it. Do you think she read it? Of course. She was nosy as hell. Tyler. What? Look. What? Where did you find that? It was on her desk with her papers. Seriously? Are you fucking kidding me? Look, we gotta be really careful not to overthink this. But it doesn't make any sense. She, she was mad, right? She was mad I, I, I cut my hair. She attacked me because I cut my hair. She was mad and she attacked you. We both saw it. Then what is this shit? I don't know. I don't know. Tyler, come here. She can't do this to me. Not now. When I've finally made sense of a few things. I'm so lost. Well, that was your first mistake. Thinking the world made any kind of sense. Ten years in the grave, and she's still finding new ways to piss us off. Yeah. I think I need some air. Are you really, really sure? I am. Do it. Okay. Uh, here we go. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Is it all gone? Yeah. It, it looks amazing. <laughs> really? Yeah. <laughs> I can't wait to show mom. She's been so sad lately. More than sad. She's been scary. Yeah, but not tonight though. It was almost like a party. <gasps> thank you, Allison. You don't have to thank me. You're my sister. I feel more like like your brother. Brother, sister, we look out for each other. But I'm pretty sure I just gave you a really bad haircut. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Mom? Mom?
wrong. Wait! Stop! What the hell is going on? Glad we found your diary. Me too. I guess she was trying to figure out where you were at. Yeah, well, she should have asked. I wasn't some goddamn research project, I was her child. About the book. Raising your transgender child? Do you even know how rare these books were in 2005? Was she trying to figure out how to support me? Maybe. Which, she wasn't trying. She never... <sighs> it doesn't make sense, I know. You cutting your hair was what set her off, right? Allison, she read my diary. She already knew. It wasn't my hair. And if we were wrong about that, fuck. You think she read it. It's possible she never even opened the diary and that things are exactly like we always thought they were. But if she did and they aren't... God, Tyler, sure. I mean, we could have been wrong. But what good does it do to ask the question now? You mean other than not having to live with the thought that my mom tried to kill me for being me? Tyler, I know you want there to be something to find. Something that'll make it all make sense. But she was unhinged. So that's it then. She was crazy. Nothing else to say. I think we'd be better off if we tried to move on. Why don't we talk to a few people who knew her? See if that book makes any sense to them. People don't want to talk about Marianne. They pretend like that night never happened. Alright my love bugs. We're gonna go ahead and stop right here. I know y'all confused as I am right now. But go ahead and fly over to the like button. Same thing in the comment section below. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.